I tell people my sister moved out west. You're a science teacher. Your husband, he renovates houses. You're thinking about moving, but you're gonna wait until the interest rates go down. That's not my story. <laughs> Before I was an Avenger, I made mistakes. And a lot of enemies. He's called Science Taskmaster. He controls the Red Room. They're manipulated. Fully conscious, but no choices. I should have come back for you. How many others are there? Enough. We have to go back to where it all started. So they never do that to anyone again. We're family. We fight with you. You won't win. I've always found it best. Not to look into the past. Okay, you got a plan or shall I just stay dug and cover? My plan was to drive us away. Well, your plan sucks. At some point, we all have to choose between what the world wants you to be and who you are. my choice. I'm done running. Here's what's gonna happen. Natasha, don't slouch. I'm not slouching. You're going to get a big hunch. You listen to your mother. Oh my God, this... Up, up, listen. All right, enough, all of you. I didn't say anything. That's not fair. What are you doing here in Somerville anyway? Honestly, my mom won't say it, but we're completely broke. And the only thing that's left in our name this is creepy old farmhouse our grandfather left us in the middle of nowhere. Why'd you bring me up here? Entertainment value. <laughs> what is that? I don't know. Somehow, a town that isn't anywhere near a tectonic plate, that has no fault lines, no fracking, no loud music even, is shaking on a daily basis. Under the dining table now! Hey, remember that one summer we died under a table? I found this in my living room. Whoa, killer replica. A replica of what? A ghost trap? There hasn't been a ghost sighting in 30 years. New York in the 80s, it's like The Walking Dead. Your dad never mentioned this to you? It's just my mom. My grandfather died. My mom says we're just here to pick through the rubble of his life. Wait a minute. Who are you?
Whoa, whoa, stop. Don't come any closer. Mm. It's a girl. Girl, girl. Oh, my gosh, girl. I'm sorry. No, no blonde hair. I've just never, never seen a girl before. Who are you? It's so loud here. We call it the noise. Happened to all the men on this planet. Every thought in our heads were on display. Where are all the women? They're dead. No noise. Oh, what is she thinking? Where the hell is her noise? It's strange to see everything you're thinking. You know, it's strange for me too, not knowing what's going on in your head. I mean, I don't know, you might not like my dog or you want to hit me over the head with a rock or something. I like your dog. He's stronger than he knows. He knows. He knows. You better watch your noise. Snake. 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 If those men catch you, they'll kill you. Get in the boat! If you want to protect the girl, you have to leave now. Keep you safe, safe. Keep you safe. Safe. With her power, there's no telling what he can do. I need that girl before she wants him. How many are coming? A hundred? Two hundred? Thousands. Come on. I am Ty Hewitt, the man. man. Fight. Fight. Be quiet. I'm trying, I'm trying. Come on. Fight. 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 He's just resting. In pieces! That man is dead! He's so sleepy. But it's just a recreational drugs feel like? Guy, this world, it's a video game. And it's full of bad guys. I'm a rule breaker. I'm a rattle chicka 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 snaker. We need you to be the good guy. I'm sorry! Oh, God! <laughs> Is that a Glock in your pocket? No. What? It's two Glocks. Oh! I'm not gonna be the good guy. I'm gonna be the great guy. <gasps> okay. Well, enjoy your lifetime supply of virginity. <laughs> Off you go. So easy. Did you see? Oh. There's a crusade coming. Do you often dream things that happen just as you dream them? Yes. The test is simple. 
Remove your hand from the box. And you die. What's in the box? Pain. You inherit too much power. You have proven you can rule yourself. Now you must learn to rule others. Something none of your ancestors learned. My father rules an entire planet. He's losing it. He's getting a richer one. He'll lose that one too. Arrakis is a death trap. Kill him. This is an extermination. They're picking my family off one by one. Let's fight like demons. An animal caught in a trap will gnaw off its own leg to escape. What will you do? I know you. One day, the legend will be born. All of civilization depends on it. The future, I can see it. I must not fear. Fear is the mind killer. My Lord Duke. Where the fear is gone, only I will remain. Go, go, go! Hey, Jake, can I get a large bottle of that Baijiu? You know what? Make it two large bottles. How can you drink like that? I used to complain that every day felt the same, and now every day is the same. Hey, Jake. I have died 144 times, and every day ends like this. But it doesn't matter. Not when you've lost everything you've loved. Venter, man who's had me killed 150 times. The power to rewrite history is mine. Heads up. I know everything that's gonna happen. Let me charge One thing that never changes. What's up, pretty boy? Bunch of assholes killing me for reasons that remain a mystery. I am Guan Yin, and Guan Yin has done this. And Zwei. Zwei. It's for you. Roy, can you hear me? I can't explain it right now, but I'm gonna need your help. Gemma? The only woman I've ever loved and who can stop this is still alive. I have to get killed. Hi, Roy. Over and over again. Until I save her. I need to learn how to fight with a sword. I would only have a day. I think we can get a lot done in a day. Someone's been the busiest little beaver. <laughs> Stuck in the death loop because of you. Exactly. Bring them all. It's I can do this all day. only chance. We have to take it. We need Kong. The world needs him. To stop what's coming. And this child. 
She's the only one he'll communicate with. I knew that they had a bond. She had nowhere to go, so I made a promise to protect her. And I think that in some way, Kong did the same. These are dangerous times. Godzilla is out there and he's hurting people and we don't know why. Yeah. Something provoking him that we're not seeing here. I'm of the same opinion. The myths are real. Yeah. Yeah. There was a war. Come on. And they're the last ones standing. I keep reaching for greatness because I'm built from it. Who bows to who? Nobody gonna stop for me. Here we go. Kong bows to no one. Here we go. I've known you since you were a child. Please! You have a gift. You always have. If there's an answer to your disease, you'll find it. I should have died years ago. I'm still here if not to fix this. I have a rare blood disease and I'm running out of time. This could be my last chance. You're up to something, what is it? That's not exactly legal. I want to see you get hurt more than you already have. This would be a cure. At what cost? Speed. The ability to use echolocation. And an overpowering urge to consume blood. How far are we allowed to go? To fix something that's broken. until the remedy <laughs> is worse than the disease. Michael Morbius. Got tired of doing the whole good guy thing, huh? What's up, Doc? I have, through dreaming and waking up, lived thousands of different lifetimes. There are fundamental metaphors about reality, waking up from a dream. We have this cognitive experience of shifting between realities. There's another world behind this world. 
Okay, so this is going to set the tenor for everything. We are living in a computer programmed reality. Simulation theory is the idea that this is all fake. The Matrix was real. We are being inhabited by some sort of player. I would start giving myself tests. I'm thinking of someone and I turn the corner and there they are. The only clue we have is when some alteration in our reality occurs. We are living in a simulation. Okay, so what do I do with that? I don't know. Enjoy it. Simulation theory is a blending of religion and science. This is a way to deal with the complexity of human existence. What's the point of laws? What's the point of all this? This is what it feels like to be alive right now. The inability to separate real world from digital reality. A world without rules, controls. People are scarcely real to me. Because it's a game. There's a lot of very dark forces on the horizon. There are things that are trying to manipulate me. This world is capable of falling apart. Somebody's got to be putting their hand on the scale. The creator of the game. There are people out there worth saving. 